You're here because you walked out on stage before we rolled the cameras and you said, you're here to save your life. I am. And Susan, I wanna offer you the floor now because you've come out the other end of this food addiction. Yeah. What do you recommend? Where does Wendy go from here? So the first thing is, and you know this, right? You have a very addictable brain. So you're dealing with addiction, right? And you've dealt with addiction before. And with addiction, you've got to quit, right? You didn't go on a nicotine maintenance program, moderation program when you wanted to, to get healthy from cigarettes, right? You quit smoking. You need a bright line, which means a clear, unambiguous boundary that you just don't cross. And you need that for sugar and flour. Now, it's not easy to do because it's everywhere. So you need a roadmap to follow and you need a lot of support. And obviously, this isn't something you're going to overcome in one day or one visit here on the set of The Doctors. But it seems to me like you're ready to make a change. And Susan, I know that, that you're, you're here because you're willing to help Wendy make a change. I am. Yeah, I have a program called Bright Line Eating. Now, I don't work with people individually I anymore. I lose 300 <laughs> because everybody could relate to you. You were just such a wonderful, warm, relatable person. Thank you. I and I think it's so great that you're coming and sharing your story because there are viewers out there struggling with the same addictions and the same issues, and you're inspiring them. You're giving them hope and letting them know they can change their life too. The key is, you know, and Susan will know everything about this, it's the thinking. I. It doesn't even matter all of the other accomplishments. I'm so stuck in the old tapes and going back to the old way that I feel, and it's just imperative, the psychological impact that addiction has wrought onto everything that I do, everything that I think, and you know what? It doesn't matter all my accomplishments in my life. I always go back to that place when I was a young child feeling so insecure and so unlovable, and that's for another time. Well, probably. we like you, and we want you around <laughs> for a long time, so Susan. <laughs> You're gonna offer some resources. So here's what we've got for you, Wendy. I'm gonna work with you for as long as it takes for you to get happy, thin, and free. We'll do it together. So <laughs> you are saving my life, and I would do anything because if Susan and I together with your help can help one person out there. I'm 59, it, well, almost. It's not easy, you know, being middle-aged, losing weight, you know. So if I can do it, seriously, anyone can do I it. I love that message, and I'll tell you what. What's great also, Susan, her book is called Bright Line Eating, and everyone in the audience is going over the coffee. So courtesy of Susan. Thank you both so very much. Go ahead, everyone.